Hi, everyone. Well, we're trying again. We went slightly wrong last time, but now we've done it again. I think we're there. So I'm really excited for the cook along. That one person who is watching, I hope you can get on again because it is exciting. So I'm all here with all my stuff and my so called three eggs rather than two, as you all know. And basically, I'm really looking forward to doing this with the kids as well. I think it'll be very exciting. What is nice to go with this, though, is some maybe broccoli spares or any vegetable you've got could be really lovely to go with it. So if you want, this is the time to go and do it. Even frozen peas is great with it. So this is the time if you want to go and get some veg to go with it. There's plenty of time to get it sorted. Anyway, I'm making toad in the hole. A lovely tote in the hole, and I'm doing caramelized onion to go with it. Really traditional, really old fashioned, but really delicious. The children love it, and it's perfect for Saturday night. So I'm really looking forward to showing you and showing you how I do it. I have to tell you, there are hundreds of ways of cooking Yorkshire pudding. That is not so much the ways. It's the ingredients. So many different people do it so many different ways. I mean, it's the one thing that people question. Do I do the best Yorkshire pudding? Well, this is a definitive one. If you stick with this, you can't go wrong. Okay, bye. See you later.